happy friday i decided to do the friday chit chat um if the light's too bright or anything jason got me a new ring light for christmas so i'm learning the settings so we will figure it out it's not bright enough see and then there's really bright let me know as we go and this is going to make it easier to move into the other room for the other setup um so let's see what we got going on first i'm gonna i'm gonna use one of the new palettes i got for christmas it's a two-faced one um well actually it's gonna be all i use basically because i got um for christmas i got quite a few i'm gonna record that after this but um i did um post a picture um the morph he got me a morphe palette that was from the jeffree star which we all know i got already so i went and returned it and got some other things um but anyways i'm trying to hopefully i could get these videos pumped out for you every day this really makes my eyes pop don't it all right <laughs> Let's use my Sonia. Actually, first let's do the um, Maybelline concealer. So, um, Eric had a good Christmas. I hope every one of y'all had a good Christmas as well. What do I do with the sponge? Let me get my, there it is, my Sonia Kaushik sponge. I'm just gonna put some of this concealer because Eric decided he was gonna get up at 2 a.m. last night. So, um, I did not get any sleep. My windshield got broke yesterday on my car. I mean, it's not broke, I could still use the car, but um, I don't have a mirror. So I'm using the camera. Um, but I was on my way to Slidell to get a few things we needed. One of which I forgot was probably crackers, but Eric's been eating a lot of his crackers lately. So um, he had more than I thought he, he had less than I thought he did. So there's that. Um, but I have to um, go get that tonight when Jason gets home from his job. Um, not sure if I'm going. Okay, anyways, back on the subject. Um, I was driving um, from the Mississippi border into the back road that takes you into Slidell, Louisiana. And um, all of a sudden I heard a pop. And I didn't see nothing because I knew that pop sound was like glass. And I looked at the windshield and I kind of looked in the mirror to look at the back and there was nothing there. So I was like, okay, well, good thing. It didn't break nothing, whatever it was. There was a big truck that passed by at the same time. Oh, I'm using the Clinique foundation and I use the um, Makeup Revolution Hydration Foundation um, Primer. Um, but. I looked, I didn't see nothing, and as I get a little bit down the road, a crack starts to come down on the driver's side. It's halfway across now. It's three or four hundred dollars to replace it. I'm gonna do it when I get home because I'm on the back roads. <laughs> and just in case, I would I think it's better just to do it when I get home. That way, um, I don't have to worry about it getting cracked again right away. I'm gonna pull this down my neck. When I go get his crackers tonight, I might end up buying another liquid bronzer, a contour, I mean, because I noticed I didn't put one in here. I'm supposed to have a girl's day with um, Mary one day and um, not sure what we're doing that day. Not sure if we're really having one because she gave me a gift card to Ulta, which I used to get some of the stuff, so. All right, um, 
I'm gonna go ahead and close the Clinique foundation up. Here's what it here's what it looks like. Alright, um, now we're gonna take some of the um color pop concealer and just brighten under the eye. Eric's trying to see in the camera. It's so nice that he can't walk behind the camera right now. He's not used to the light oh. yet, so he's trying to figure out what I'm doing. There's even a microphone that comes with this that I might try out a couple of times. First, like I'm not using it right now but I will eventually try to use it and we will see what happens and y'all can let me know if the sound is better or if it's too loud or whatever. All right, now we're gonna take the Tarte powder. Uh, I have a powder brush somewhere right here. We're gonna take this tart powder. And set the face. But yeah, um, that broke. Eric got some really good toys. He's liking his um, Buzz Lightyear. His um, Woody. He has a train set. He has a talking Tom. That's one of his favorite things is talking Tom. It's so funny. I never expected him to like that. But he does. He loves talking Tom. Okay. So there's the powder. That was the tart powder. All right. Now, I don't think I need, um, yeah, I need this. I need eyes. I'm gonna use one of the Too Faced gift sets because they do still have them at least on TooFaced.com and I think also on the Sephora and um, Ulta sites that you can still get them. So I'm going to be using the one that's shaped as a star today. It's got blush, bronzer, highlighter, and eyeshadow. So technically it has everything we need except for brow gel I'm letting them grow out I'm not messing with them I'm letting them grow out so I can get them done and this set even came with lipstick and better than sex mascara but I already have one in here so I'm not gonna open that one because I want to use the first one. but this has a lip gloss it looks like that and it's in the shade ginger snap it's a really pretty gloss. Um, here's the packaging. This is what the palette looks like. It's got a little gingerbread woman on it. You can see there's the bronzer. And if you notice, I gotta get this plastic piece off. Hold on. I will post this swatched of this. I did it last night. If you will notice, each little triangle has its own color story. I gotta get used to this light. There we go. See, when you put this over there, those three colors go with that. Those four colors go with that. These four colors go with that. See how it's got its own little color story each window you open? All right. First, let's go in with the um, Chestnuts Roasting Bronzer. It's right there. I got a new bronzing brush yesterday because I forgot mine. And I think I just dug into the eyeshadow. Um, I got this kit. They're Real Technique brushes. It came with a sponge as well. These are the brushes. First, I wanna use this one. This is Expert Face Brush. 
It's um, 200, RT 200. All right. So we're gonna use that like we would normally use that um, other brush I have at home. And we're gonna stick the contour and slash bronzer in the spots we want it originally. And then we'll use the fluffier brush to move it around. Oh, I know it just okay. Um, now we're gonna use this fluffier brush. Watch out. And we're just gonna do the contours of the face. Mm -hmm. I think he's trying to see what mommy's doing. And usually he's to the side of me. Now he's directly in front of me. What are you doing? Okay. It's good practice for when we move into the other room right now. Okay, and I also bought a Morphe brush for the blush, and I'm gonna use, I'm gonna go ahead and use Nice List. It's a peachish, peach type shade. Because the I didn't bring ones that, I didn't bring enough brushes, basically, is what it comes down to to be able to do my blush and bronzer, which is why you haven't seen many videos since I got here. It's a very pretty color. All right, and the highlighter, I want to use, let me show you what they both look like. They're both very pretty. I want to use the lighter one, I think. The lighter one is called Lit Up. It's next on the other side of the bronzer. So we're going to find a highlight brush. We're going to use a setting brush. It's not real shiny, but it's enough. Mm -hmm. Let's take um, this brush again. Okay. All right, now I want to take this MAC Fixing Spray. I've had that for a while. I just never use it because I always have my favorites. One of the things I did was pack stuff that I don't use a whole lot. Oh, now the, now the highlighter shows up. Let's move you in closer so I could do the eyeshadow. Okay. Let's see. Let me get the eye brushes out of here. Um, how was y'all's Christmas? And you, um, by the way, I would like to hear some of the things y'all got, if you don't mind. Um, first color I'm going to go into is Toast. It's up here. It's that color right there. Like I said, I'll post the swatch on pictures on my Insta today so you can see. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. That was supposed to be much lighter than it came out. So we will. Keep blending it in. That's supposed to be a transition color, not 
the whole eye color, but we will deal with it. Okay. fix that pretty good I guess all right now we will take they call this a crease brush yeah we're not using that for a crease brush my crease ain't that huge um let's grab a brush where is my crease brush and that's the highlighter brush I think there's a crease brush okay for the crease let me see. Snuggle weather and it might end up being snuggle weather. This purple is patchy. Look at that. See that purpley color is patchy. Hmm. Let's go with um I think this cranberry is patchy also. Yeah. Let's try Deepest Desires, the purpley color, see if we can get something going. It's always starting out on the edge. See what I mean by patchy? I mean, it's rather beautiful shade though i might have to get something with a mirror out hold on this is my two-faced natural okay yeah it looks good tapping into it again start on the edge and pull it through pick up that other mirror real quick while I finish the side because this is a side that don't want to take pigment usually so I want to make sure to get the color in there and that it matches Maybe not tap the color off so much. There we go. This eye just always wants to give me a hard time. Now I'm going to take a blending brush. We'll take this deluxe crease brush. And we'll go across the top of this. Because it's nice and dense. And it actually blended pretty good. We're gonna go in with look at all these beautiful shimmer shades the gold kind of reflects off the light um so frosty i'm just gonna swatch the ones that are calling to me jingle mingle bells and whistles Uh, 
I kind of like that one. I think that's Jingle. I think actually that's so frosty. It's on here. Yeah, that's so frosty. It's like a duo chrome shade. It's right here. So we're gonna use that one as the um, lid shade. Let me go ahead and grab a brush. And we're gonna go into So Frosty. And we're tapping it on the lid. I'm here for another week. Um, I want to try to record some things, but we can't really, taking Eric outside is hard because he thinks he's going to the, the P word. They have a pool here. Okay, might have to use our fingers. Maybe if I get up there, you can see it's not going on. So we're gonna rub it with our fingers and tap it onto the eyelid. All right, let me get in the flat brush again and see if I can find. Went into prance around. It seems to come off on the brush better. All right, now we're gonna take this brush that doesn't have anything on it. We're gonna go back into I'm going into cinnamon and we're gonna mess up the whole eye look. Or not. Alright. Oh, I didn't bring an eyeliner. At least not one I could see in this basket. Okay, now we're gonna take this brush again and fluff that across. Take this and just kind of clean up the edges just a little. All right, I want to take this little brush here and we're gonna put North Pole in the inner corner. I'm 
it's like a white shimmery type shade This is a lip brush, but you don't have to always use them for what they're supposed to be used for or what they say to use them for. I still had eyeshadow on my hanger. I was just trying to make a, a line across there and I messed it up, but oh well. I want to. Okay. Let's go ahead and take lit up again and buff it into the yeah upper brow. I'm going to take Let It Glow, the darker highlight. Let's move it back so we can see what the um, look looks like. Okay. Let's go ahead and I like this palette. Take some working with, but it probably doesn't help that I have a new setup here and I'm trying to figure it all out. Plus, I'm not at home with all my brushes and all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and put this lip gloss on. Mmm. It smells really good. Let's grab an eye mascara. I'm going to use the one I brought with me. That's called Be that's the Better Sex. And that's the final look. We'll go ahead and spray some setting spray. I may need to see if they have my setting spray at Walmart when I go there later. Okay, we'll call that the final look. All right, I hope y'all have a wonderful weekend. I'm going to try to record some more videos in a minute, but I got to take care of Eric first. Okay, see y'all in the next one. Bye.